thesmartlocal.com I would like to apologise officially for cheating. <laughs> it was very uncalled for, yeah? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to the episode of TSL Plays and today we are at PSB Academy and I'm going to be putting my friends to the test against the students here to see who is smarter. Here are the rules! Battle of the Brains The two teams will be competing against each other through a series of questions. General knowledge, business, math and science. For every question, only one member from each team will answer. Both teams will have a total of three chances to opt for a hint or get help from their teammates at any point of time. The team with the most points wins! Let the battle begin! We are team... Denim, 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 Denim! Why not funny, man? Not funny. Hello, guys. We are... Sleep Deprived. <laughs> Alright, the first round is general knowledge. First question is How many legs does a lobster have? Uh, last time I ate lobster was quite long ago. Uh, I cannot remember. But I watched Finding Nemo recently. Uh -huh. Let me try to think. Okay. Okay. Bye, 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 bye. But I don't eat lobsters. Oh. It's been a long time since I ate lobster. In 3, 2, 1. Bam! <laughs> Sleep Deprived says 8 and Denim says 10. The answer is 10. Yeah! <laughs> okay, can you please explain to me your, your thought process? Firstly, I spelled out lobster. Uh -huh. And then we realised the L in the O looks like the number 10. Oh! oh. So, so smart. It's a miracle lah, I think. You don't need to think so hard. You don't need to think the so hard. Comes naturally. This one, can I just say that Brenda Coffin don't know? How many teeth does the average adult human have? What? Who says so sad? <laughs> Sleep deprived is like Are you so calm at the moment. Sure. Okay. Yes. Alright, I trust you. I trust you. Are you guys ready? Yeah. In yeah, three. Ready. I'm born ready. Okay. Whoa. Look, they can never keep me down. I'm going. In. Whoa. He is born ready. Can you beat that, Brenda? I was drawing. Okay, I was done years ago. Okay. Answers, please. Thirty-two. 32 for both, that is correct! They also have a drawing. Yeah. <laughs> what is the name oh of the artist oh. yes. who created this famous painting? Yes, Megan, you are artistic. Yes, you know, you're so good. <laughs> 3, 2 1. Answers, please. Both. Correct! I forgot to Where are the illustrations? Wait, wait, wait. Let me see the spelling. Like both is correct. Good job, good job, good job. Woo. I drew him with one ear because he famously cut his ear off. Oh, wow. Ah, I see, I see, I see. I didn't draw the ear because it's not there. <laughs> Alright, now we are going to go on to round two, which is the business questions. It is an MCQ question. Four options. Alright, the question is, the agreement of partnership, A, must be oral, B, must be in writing, C, can either be oral or in writing, or D, must be in writing on a stamped paper. We got answer already, man. Just, just yeah, nice I uh, learned this subject. In, uh, it's called business law. Oh. So just to happen is one of the questions. Oh, so smart. Please reveal your answers now. The agreement of partnership is... The correct answer is C. Yay! Can either be oral or in writing. <laughs> Team Denim gets the point for woo, this question. Woo, woo, woo. I think we need to sing our song. Five, six, seven, eight. Denim, 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 denim. Da -da -denim. <laughs> this one is an open ended question, so I would expect the keywords to be in there. What is the difference between profit and revenue? <laughs> I see your face, I cannot. Uh, if you ask me last time in JC when I took econs, yeah, I know. I think this was to come here. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Brenda, you go first. Profit For me? Then you remove the expenses and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Profit is total amount earned minus cost. Revenue is total amount earned. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yep, yep. Yeah, the gist of it. I mean, okay, it's fine. Okay, how about sit deprived? 
a profit relates to like the sales gained. I mean, I want to write cost, but there's no space on this tiny whiteboard. So in revenue, I wrote ROI, returns of investment, the company gains after like taking into consideration different factors. All right, so one point goes to Team Denim. Yay! Third question, business category. The long-term assets that have no physical existence but are rights that have value is known as... Okay, let me give you a hint. Uh. You need to focus on the phrase, no physical oh, existence. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, I was right just... No physical existence. In 3, 2, 1, please flash your answers. Go! Oh, B! B! Yay! That is correct! Intangible assets. <laughs> Why a ghost? Why a ghost? Intangible. Yeah. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Categories: mathematics. Uh, Still, the price says that they Don't will. Don't take a break or something. Huh? <laughs> Don't take a break. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh shit! Oh, let's take a break at your feet. Without further ado, calculate the volume of this L-shaped prism. What the? Hey, wait, hey, wait, this, wait, this, this cannot be easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even I know how to do yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> This should be easy. Draw it out. Yes, right. I think he has to draw it out. Look at the shape. Feel the shape. He's doing like literally mental calculations. He's like looking at it. I mean, look, he has got a turtle neck. He, look, he is smart. He looks the part. Oh yeah, I'm logging up next week. <laughs> Three, two, one. Flash your answers, please. So it's a bit small. 28,000 millimeter Yay. cube. Yay. Nice. We are so finally. Hold up. Did you just add no. in? Never, never. They put 28,000 millimeter square just now. Never. I saw with my eyes, the camera. <laughs> Alright, next question. You will not need your whiteboards. What you will do is that you will see the paper stone and see who will start first. And you have to recite the multiples of six. I'm shaking, okay. Scissors, paper, stone. Oops, oh, they start first because they won. Oh, but then like that, if they start first, then I can hear what. Yeah, it was like, no, it's Nixon, Mako. So six. six. <coughs> Wait, what you call me? <laughs> what did you what did you just call your team member? Mako. Six. Six is. Eh? Oh, already? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Twelve. <laughs> I'm thinking. Bella can sleep <laughs> while we're having a competition. I don't want the external forces to affect my intelligence. Alright, so no chances are, the moment you get it wrong, you are out. Uh, the point will go to the other team. So before I will start first, ready, go. 6 12 18 24 30 36 84 Yay! <laughs> it's 100 and 2, why you go backwards? People go forward, babe! Hey. Wow! So we win now! You are lucky! Wow, we're lucky! Yes, so I was about to be going down there. <laughs> The point goes to Denim. <laughs> Why you go backwards, bro? <laughs> Ready for the last mathematics question. Two numbers are in the ratio of four is to five. The sum of the numbers is one three five. Find the numbers. Can do it bigger, so no worries. One unit is 15, so now you find what is 4 units and what is 5 units. You have a devil in our midst. It seems that the name already has the answer. Hey, check, 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 check. <laughs> pass, pass, pass together, correct. Okay, yeah, the clue has just Fine. informed me that just now Brenda was cheating. What did she do? What did Brenda do? Oh. She helped Megan. At least you want to cheat, put the mic down. La. She literally here. <laughs> oh yeah, oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, I forgot that Tim can hear everything because I was literally like, Yeah, you do this, then you do that. Ah, <laughs> cheating ah! I will not count the answer because they cheated. Mm, okay. Kela, Kela, Kela. Got your answer? Yeah. 60 and 75. 60 and 75 is indeed correct! We also got the answer! <laughs> okay, science category. Question number one. Name one digestive enzyme in the digestive system. Okay, okay the simplest one. This is easy. Oh. I, think I think the answer is very simple. Like it's like the answer once they show then they confirm like, ah shit. Do you all know? No. I don't know, I don't know. But we can get hint from producer. No, I want to get the hint from him. He, he looks like he knows. No, if you want the hint, I can give you the hint. So you want to use oh. your hint? Okay, yes please. Hint, hint it up. 
You stupid idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a nice Wait, what, what does it say? What? Does it help you? <laughs> you want to give us a hint? <laughs> uh, it's okay. I'll give you more support. Oh wow. Thank, wow. Thank you so much. I don't know if this is a word. <laughs> so, please flash your answer to the camera in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Elective. It's very close eh. They write also, they write like this. Wait, wait, what did you write? What did you write? Elective. <laughs> Alright, so that is correct. Both teams get the point. Eh? When, no, we don't, we, we don't. We don't have to do But it is part of the... <laughs> oh my god! Hey, talk, talk for the camera, talk, talk! Yes. <laughs> dance like that. No, I dance better. <laughs> so, Hafiz, your guess actually was a smart guess. Thank you! <laughs> Be very happy, very happy, very happy. <laughs> Question number two is One cannot see through a fog because. What? <laughs> <laughs> My son spell, man! Hey, imagine, imagine. Okay, okay. Yeah, you just have to imagine. I thought it's frog. Same, I thought it was frog as well. <laughs> because. Creative intake of water is the same same thing as like. It's like when you look through a swimming pool, right? Mm -hmm. You can see the bottom. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. But the reflective index, right, of water in the swimming pool and the water in the fog is like the same, right? Yeah, because you know when there's fog, right? Then when the light shines, then the entire section of fog will light up. Then you cannot see anything in front of you. Mm -hmm. Right? That makes sense, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's very good. That's very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. It's a good, a good direction, right? Yes, okay. Yes. So it's either A, B, C, or D, eh? <laughs> <laughs> No! Happy to not listening to her! I'm gonna give you guys 10 more seconds to think of the answer. Go with your gut. What's your gut say? Go with your leg this. That's right. my gut lah. Yes. Okay. okay. Right. I believe in your gut. Okay. okay. One cannot see through a fog because please flash your answers. Please, 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 please. What is your answer? D. 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 D
a lot of the points that we got were based on guesses, mm. whereas the points that they got were actually um, based on like actual knowledge and proper inference. Yeah. Uh, girls, speak for yourselves because I believe my ability was uh, clearly shown through in my answering. Thank you PSB Academy for making this video possible. PSB Academy actually offers 16 disciplines with various courses for you to choose from. For more details, you can check out the description box down below. Thank you for watching this episode of TSL Plays. Remember to like, share and subscribe. Ring the notification bell down below. And watch our other videos over there. Bye! 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 Bye. Bye. Time to study. Come PSB Academy.